Hey guys, Scott from Trump Bee Company here. We're gonna go down to the bee yard and mark some drones. Got my paint pens ready. Uh, we'll talk about why we're gonna do that as we get into the video a little bit. So let's head down to the bee yard. Here we are, at the bee yard. Alright guys, so for today's video what we're going to do is we're going to mark some drones. Um, I'm doing this for um, a program I'm involved in through Penn State. It's called the EPIC program, the Education and Production and Insemination of Queens. And um, one of the things we're doing for the project is uh, measuring drone drift. And so what I'm going to do is in two different colonies, I'm going to mark 50 drones in each colony. I'm going to mark two different colors so we can track what, um, if there is drifting, which drones came from which colony. And for this I'm going to use, I think I'll do pink and I'll do orange. Uh, if you have any ideas as to why I'm not using your standard five colors of the green, yellow, white, red, or blue, if you think you know why I'm not using these, um, leave that down in the comments. I'll let you know if you guessed it right. Alright, so let's break into the colony, find some drones. Um, so this one on the end of row two I'm going to do pink. And so let's dig into the colony and find some drones. All right, so we have a frame here. There's a lot of drones here. Um, so what we're going to do is just going to find some drones and we're going to mark them. So you don't have to worry about the drone stinging. You see that? Got a drone here. Gotta zoom further out. And then to mark it. Let's put a little dot right in the middle of his back. If I can get this. It's hard to get the angle just right here for you. Okay, so then I just put the dot right. Alright, that was a little bit messy because I was trying to make sure it was in camera range. But there we go. Mark drone. Kind of doing it the lazy way here. When I see the drones walking by, I just give them a quick dot on the back. All right. So you can kind of see here we have some dotted drones around here. I'm going to keep going until I have 50 and then we'll go on to the next colony.
don't know if you can see that. The little horns there. So that's step one. And then focus here. Got this other part that comes out afterwards. Now this one looks clear to me. Yeah, it's pretty clear. Oh, these flies are terrible. Um, so that was a really young drone there, but um, yeah, that, that was a, a pretty good little experiment. Let me know what you guys think is going to happen. So the way the bee yard is set up, there's one, two, three, so there's five hives per row. And so there's a total of 15 colonies in this yard. Let me know if you think they're going to go one hive away, two hives away, maybe different rows. Um, what do you guys think the drifting is going to be like? And I'm going to give it two weeks and I'm going to come back and check all 15 and see what we have for drones. Um, do you think they're going to go to the beekeeper five houses down the road? Um, how far do you think the drifting is going to go? So let me know what you guys think and I'll let you know the results uh, in the next video. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.